Hey, what's up everybody? So what today I'm going to bring you a short little video on how to jailbreak your Apple TV second generation. So not the third, but the second, the one that's 720p. I mean, it's very simple. First, we're going to download Season Pass, which I've already done. I'll include the links in the description below of where you can find it. But you will go ahead and download it, install it, run it. I've got my Apple TV sitting right here with... Uh, a micro USB cable attached to it, but do not plug it into your computer yet. Okay. Um, first, what you're going to do is you're going to create this uh, IPSW. What it's going to do is it's going to reach out, grab the firmware from it, so it'll crack it and it'll prompt you when to plug in your Apple TV. So let's get started. While this is doing this, uh, in order to jailbreak it, what it's going to do is it's going to allow you to install a bunch of different features on your Apple TV, like Plex. Uh, XBMC if you need it. Uh, you can surf the web from it. I mean there's all kinds of things you can do to your Apple TV to make it like a Roku or um, Samsung, those things they got. Uh, you can do all kinds of sort of things with it. So that's what I'm trying to show you guys here is how simple it is these days to jailbreak it which is completely legal and make it do whatever it is you want it to do. The length of time that it takes to download it really depends on your internet connection. Uh, if you have a slow internet connection, it may take some time. You can just set it, forget it, and come back to it, or whatever you want to do. Now it's taking the file that it downloaded and it's converting it so that way it jailbreaks it and it saves it as an image in iTunes. So it's like thinking that it's restoring itself to a previous version, but it's really just loading in the jailbroken image. All right, now that we got the image down and it's converted it, it wants you to go ahead and plug it up. So you're going to take your micro USB cord, plug it into the back of the Apple TV, and then plug the USB end into the computer, which I'm doing so now. Now what you're going to do is you got to put it in this DFU mode. So you're going to take your silver remote, hold down the menu button and the pause button for seven seconds. That's until it starts like flashing steadily. And it may take you a couple of times to get into this DFU mode. It's not the easiest thing to do. Alright, now that it found it, 
it's going to go ahead and start the process of uploading the jailbreak. While this is doing this, a little trick that I learned is, is in order to get into that DFU mode, you may have to plug the power cord in while it's plugged in with the USB. That's what I had to do, but you may get lucky and not have to, but just keep that cable around just in case you need it. And there we go. It is completely jailbroken. Now all you gotta do is just unplug it from your computer, plug it back into your TV, turn it on, and you should see the new Season Pass logo within it. So I hope you guys like what you saw. I hope you learned something. Um, if you did, make sure you like, subscribe, check us out on Facebook, check out our website. Uh, send us some suggestions on what you want to see. Uh, we'd be more than happy to do some for you. So maybe next time I'll jailbreak some wild turkey. Hope you guys like. We'll see you later.